going down the ground there. The Continent T20 Victorious Uganda Cricket Cranes will regroup on Monday next week to resume preparations for the T20 World Cup qualifiers due in Namibia later this year. The Cricket Cranes, who are expected to have a non-residential camp in Kampala at the Lugogo Cricket Oval, will travel to Namibia on the 3rd of July for the Castle Light T20 Series before returning to Windhoek in November for the World Cup qualifiers. Head coach Lawrence Maatlani, who guided the Cranes to victory in the inaugural Continent T20 tournament held in Nairobi this week, believes the experience gained from the tournament will be key in their next international engagements. We mustn't forget that 90% of the team had never played at Gahanga in international, uh, and you played against a lot of experienced guys. So uh, I don't think going away from home you're ever a uh, favorite. But uh, yeah, so for me personally, it was, it was good to see the boys come through. And uh, I think we got some good hard cricket before uh, going through to Namibia. However, Mahatlani, who is yet to name his final squad, says he will give more opportunity to players in the under-19 national team in a bid to increase his squad depth. If we look at our last three ICC tournaments, uh, the challenge B here in Uganda, we lost Deos Mohomoza just before the tournament. Uh, the challenge being Jersey, we lost Brian Masaba just before the tournament. Uh, the ICC qualifiers for the 2024 World Cup, or for the 2023 World Cup, we lost uh, both Brian and Dales just before the tournament. So in building depth and experience, hopefully this will help us in ensuring that um, we become competitive, even if injuries or uncertainties happen. Nsubu Gasiraj, who made his debut in the Continent T20 series in Nairobi, utilized his opportunity with a fine display managing 10 wickets at the tournament. Nsubuga, who is optimistic of a second call-up, believes the Namibian trip is inevitable for the Cranes ahead of the World Cup qualifiers. I think it's going to be like a test for us because uh, we have to see the mistakes out. We have to like get used to the weather and know everything, the wickets. Yeah, so it's going to be good for us, like, to know and what we shall do during the qualifiers. Noah Walakira, NTV Sport.